sometimes they think we're a meat a meat shop m-e-a-t yeah. so like a meatery so um so it's just a lot of uh, education and just letting people know what it's like. A trip to the family-owned and operated White Bear Meadery is more than just sampling an ancient honey-made wine. So this is our tart cherry mead called Viking's Blood. It's a trip back in time, an experience where history and taste testing go hand in hand, encouraging customers to drink like a Viking. Wherever they had honey, then eventually they, they made uh, mead. Owner Josh Ecton wears all hats, serving as mead maker, bartender, and custodian. His love of mead is what led him to open shop seven months ago. My wife and I have enjoyed meads over the years, and whenever we found it, we like to, uh, you know, um, get a bottle or have a glass and. Uh, something that we've enjoyed and we couldn't find a lot of. With only a handful of commercial mead makers in Minnesota, Ecton started with two varieties and now has nine. He says patrons are either quite familiar making their own mead at home or know next to nothing. Mead is a fermented uh, honey beverage um, that can, can use just uh, honey as a base or we can add spices or fruits to it to make different varieties of meads. Ecton says word has gotten out and business is up. They have an online store and in-house products for sale, keeping their goods and ingredients Minnesota made. We try to source our ingredients as much as possible from Minnesota farms. Uh, all of our honey is from um, um, Minnesota. Enlisting the help of family and friends, his wife and kids all play a role in the business, if only in a playful capacity, but fitting for a family-friendly space. Catering to those excited to try a new twist on an old classic. We love making uh, mead and uh, you know having it having it available for Minnesotans to come in and, and taste. So that's that's wonderful. We're sharing something that we've enjoyed and, uh, with with many many people now.